hello friend this is rupesh and i'm watching cvp nerds video series on ling list problems and this is going to be the first video of this full ling list interview question series and as the title says that given a singly ling list like this i want you to find kth node but from back side so if i'll say 2 then i want this one if i'll say 1 then i'll say i want this one if i will say 4 then i need this one means from back side and in your hand you will be having this head so this is a full leg list you have this head in your hand so this is the head so you have this node in your hand and if i will say i want first node or second node or fifth node or eighth node that node you will count from back side and i want you to give that number so let's quickly see how we'll do that so the idea is but before going for the implementation i would recommend please pause this video and think about it for some time so that you will have some pressure on your mind and even if you cannot think about it and if i tell you the answer you will be able to remember that answer for longer time so put some effort let's go for the solution so basically you need two pointers here this is going to be p1 and this is going to be p2 and if i say i want second number or for simplicity i would say i want third number from back then what you do you just increment this pointer p2 for three times i mean you are already at first point so this is going to be the second point and this is going to be the third point so move your p2 here now your p2 is pointing to this one and no one is pointing here now so only p1 is pointing here okay now you simultaneously move p2 and p1 one by one and magically when this p2 will reach and let's suppose p2 is here this p1 would have reached to this guy and i asked three from back right so this is the third one from back hey guys time for a quick pause and what you are seeing right now is my patreon page so if you don't know what is patreon it's a crowdfunding website where you can support any content creator like me and in return you get rewards so If you join me, I can be your private tutor, or you just want to chat with me and ask your doubts, or maybe you just want to support me with very small amount, and I'll still have something for you. So do visit my Patreon page and see if you like it. And if you want to discontinue any time, you can do that. So if you have already visited my Patreon page, let's continue our video now. So P1 will give you the answer. I'll repeat this quickly. Just listen this carefully. We need two pointers, P1, P2. and if i'll say fourth from back then increment this p2 three times because you are already at first position so second position third position and fourth position move your p2 here and then this p2 will not be there only p1 is pointing here now after moving this p2 here just move p1 and p2 simultaneously one by one so at some moment p2 will be here p1 will be here p2 will be here and p1 will be here so once this p2 is reaching till the end because you will get to know that okay this node is end because there is nothing in the next so by the time you reach here p2 is actually pointing the fourth element i mean node from the back so this is how you solve this problem and don't think i'll be showing you the program or something here because that is a waste of time and no one ask you actually to write the program for all these things because they are tricky questions and they just want to check your thinking if you can think something like this so this was problem number 1 there will be many many more problem in th this video series so if you want to complete your ling list topic on interviews then this full series would be so helpful for you and i'll give you the link of this full playlist in inside this description so you can get it from there thanks for watching guys i love you and thanks for your support and if you are new to this channel don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button guys i'll see you in the next videos bye bye take care